program, our, our uh, partnership with ARC, we believe will specifically help specialty food companies across the state of West Virginia to expand their opportunity to export. We'll assist small entrepreneurs, small businessmen across the state in preparing for that export business, uh, making their websites international friendly, preparing them for trade shows, and assisting them as they um, export across the country. And here, what we find is a very aggressive development program, a very aggressive export program. And so here we have this great opportunity of partnering with the department so, so that they can reach further. And they're able to go and they work on small, to reach small businesses and to reach specialty foods. It's a particularly interesting and important area of development. And, uh, and as a result, we decided that this was the place that we wanted to announce and release these funds because of the great work the West Virginia Department of Development has done in this area. And we're very hopeful that with these funds and with our with, uh, continued support of ARC over the next several years, that we'll be able to grow this and that uh, West Virginia is able to reach even further what it has been able to reach. In this time of um, a lot of chatter in Washington, I know everybody's hearing it, about the fact that we have deep debt, deep deficits, we have spending issues, how are we gonna meet the challenges as we move forward in an economy that's slowing down. Well, the one way we can do it is grow our way out of it, is creating jobs, is creating jobs, which is creating exports, which create jobs right here in West Virginia. And uh, the other way we can do it is by setting priorities. Where are our dollars best targeted at the federal level to be able to help us create and grow jobs uh, and, and also help us with this enormous challenge of the debt and deficit. And I happen to believe that the ARC is one place where we should be devoting dollars. It's been successful in the past, but the most success I see from the federal level is it's not just federal dollars. It's ARC dollars, it's state dollars, it's local dollars. It's the exponential effect that the ARC funds have everywhere across this region. Uh, and we particularly get to see it in West Virginia because as, um, as the co-chair mentioned, West Virginia is, is in company, the whole, entire state is within the ARC. Businesses are telling me that one of the ways that we can improve our economy is by boosting exports from West Virginia. That's why this grant is very important. We need to continue opening new markets for West Virginia manufacturers to sell their products. I'm so pleased to partner with the Appalachian Regional Commission in this venture. I remember when I used to be uh, chairman of the, App of the Appalachian Regional Commission when I was governor. That was fun. It's a great organization. It was started to help Appalachia, and it has done a tremendous job. It's always good to have money, and that will help us expand further into the million five hundred thousand. Again, I'm going to uh, write a little of that on the bottom line here that will permit me to further uh, expand our international activities. We are always growing and always changing and always evolving and we appreciate, we certainly, certainly appreciate all of the money, the time and the effort that these organizations put in to help us succeed. We do our part and we work hard but we appreciate anything and everything that we have been able to accomplish with help from these people.